Hello, everyone. Welcome to lesson 14. This one is all about jobs. I have put a video beneath this one in the school community that you can download with different job names. OK, if you don't already know them, you can do that first. This lesson is going to be more about things related to jobs different types of jobs. So let's start. The first one is freelancer. I'm a freelancer. So this means you don't work for one company, you can work for many companies doing the same job. So for example, we have freelance writers. Freelance writers. Maybe there are many companies looking for a writer and you are freelance. So they can find you, ask you to do a job, pay you for the job, and then you can move on. So you don't work for the company full time. You're freelance. OK, next we have this man. Lots of money. He gets a good salary. Salary is how much you earn, how much money you make. Salary. Most salaries are paid every month. So he gets a good monthly salary. Okay. This one is have a full time job. This means you work maybe five days a week, maybe more. Usually it's nine to five is a full-time job. So yeah, that's self-explanatory really, full-time job. And then we have part-time job. So a part-time job, you don't work every day. You might work three days a week maybe two days a week. You work sometimes. So it's full-time, part-time. And, okay, move, get rid of these. Next, we have boss. I'm a boss. This person is the boss, okay? He's the person who makes big decisions, tells people what to do, He's the boss. I like my boss. My boss is a good boss. Or I don't like my boss. He is mean, rude, angry. Tell me, do you have a boss? And do you like them or don't you like them? Tell me why. This man is unemployed. He doesn't have a job. He is looking for a job. He's currently unemployed. This guy, his job is to hire people. This means he gives other people the job. He might work for a company. He will interview many people and he will hire the people who are the best fit for the company, hire. And this guy fires people. My job is to fire, which means to tell them they need to leave. Maybe they did a bad job. Maybe they aren't trying very hard. Maybe for another reason, they are fired. So we have hire, get the job, fire, lose the job. So I want you to match these words together. Let's put them, let me move me. Okay, move me here, maybe down here. So we can match. She is clever, but shy and energetic. Or sad. This one's a question. I sleep 10 hours. 
but I'm still sleepy. I don't like bananas, but I eat two bananas every day. So we can match these. These come together. Hello, everyone. Welcome to lesson 14. This one, we will learn about jobs. Now, if you don't already know many of the big jobs, like police officer, firefighter, teacher, there is a video in the school community of vocabulary beneath this lesson. You can download that, study that, learn the words, and then this one will be more helpful. This one, we will talk about different kinds of jobs. Okay, so let's jump in. The first one, freelancer. I'm a freelancer. This means you don't work for one company. Companies come to you. They will ask you to do a job. When you finish the job, they will give you the money and then you can go to do a different job. So freelancer, you don't work for one company. Different companies come to you to do a job. Some jobs that need freelancers are writers to do writing, maybe advertising, making videos. OK, freelance. Next, get a good salary. Salary is how much money you make every month or every week. Usually it's every month. This man gets a good salary. This one, full-time job. This means if you have a full-time job, you, you work most days. Maybe you have one or two days off a week and you might work from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. That's a normal full-time job. Full-time job. If you don't have a full-time job, you might sometimes work, and then you have a part-time job, which means you work maybe two or three days a week, not too much, but you do still work. It's a part-time job. She has a part-time job at the cafe. Now, he is a boss. He is in charge. He tells people what to do. He makes big decisions. Boss. I like my boss. He is kind. He is smart. And he is nice. I like my boss. I don't like my boss. He is mean, angry, and rude. I don't like my boss. You tell me, do you have a boss or are you a boss? And if you do have a boss, do you like them or don't you like them and why? This guy doesn't have a job. He is unemployed. He wants a job, but he is unemployed, which means he doesn't have an employer. No job, no boss, no salary, no money. This one, his job is to hire people. Hire. This means he offers them the job. He will do the interviews. If he likes someone, he will hire them, which means give them the job. The opposite of hire is buyer. This guy did a bad job and he is fired. His job is to fire people, which means tell them to leave. They can't work there anymore. Hire, fire. Now, here are some sentences. Okay. They are, we have already matched them. 
you can use these. You can read them yourself. She is clever, but shy. I sleep 10 hours, but I'm still sleepy. Okay, so note the but. You say something, but something else. Here we have or. Do you want a car or a bike? You've got two options. And here we have and. I run and listen to music. You do it at the same time. So you can use this to help you. Write these down if you need. Let's move on. I will get rid of those. And here is a example job interview. Now, I can be the interviewer. I will hire you if I like your answers. So you can write down your answers, send them to me, or take a video, send it to me, put it in the school community, and we can give feedback and tips on how to improve this. Answer the questions. Here's an example. Tell me about yourself. Well, my name's Nick, I'm 32, and I really like to help people. Why do you want this job? Because it's important for me and my career. Why must we choose you? Because I'm a very kind and responsible person. So, you answer these questions, guys. Tell me about yourself. Why do you want this job? And why must we choose you? Okay, you can write your answers, send them to me. And here are some jobs. Let's say you can choose one of these jobs to do it for. So if you want to be a pilot, write your answers as if you are interviewing to be a pilot. If you want to be a dentist, an engineer, a teacher, answer your questions for that job. You can choose any one you like, okay? I'll leave this here. You can choose one, send me your interview answers and wait for my feedback. But that is the end of lesson 14. Well done, guys. Keep up the good work. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.